May 29th has always been a remarkable day in the history of Nigeria as Democracy Day and inauguration of newly elected officers. But recently, President Muhammadu Buhari's administration decided that May 29th be set aside for the inauguration of new government, while June 12 becomes Democracy Day. On this note, men and women from all works of life and the entire people of Akwaibom State gathered at the Godswill Akwabio International Stadium, popularly called the Nest of Champions, to celebrate the inauguration of Governor Udom Emmanuel and his deputy, Mr. Moses Ekbo, into office for second tenure. <laughs> Before the arrival of His Excellency, the occasion was spiced up with performances from top music artists like Tu Baba, Casey, Harry song, choir groups, and a host of others. long, His Excellency, accompanied by his wife, the First Lady, Her Excellency, Mrs. Martha Udom Emmanuel, arrived at the stadium in the motorcade, followed by the Deputy Governor-elect, members of the State Executive Council, State and Federal House members-elect, top government functionaries, and politicians. <laughs> The governor immediately proceeded for parade inspection of the colorfully dressed officers and members of the Okwaibom State Police Command. <laughs> Next was the match pass. Colorful outfit. A very perfect, beautiful display of fitness. Goodwill messages were also presented to the state's governor by the secretary of a Kwaibom Christian Assembly, Pastor Umo Eno. Excellency, exactly four years ago, you stood on this same ground as the executive governor of a Kwaibom state. They told us that no son of Oda has ever made a second term, that you will not make a second term. and the state chairman of the People's Democratic Party, Obong Paul Ipo. The journey we started, the journey we handed over to God, that God granted us our prayers. And today, in this very hall, in this very stadium, we gathered to discover that the mandate to have came from God. And God re-established that mandate through the platform and the only living platform, the platform that has been in charge Hundred percent successes in all 
election, we want to say no to God. High point of the event was the inauguration of the Deputy Governor, Mr. Moses Ekwu, and the State Governor, Mr. Udom Emmanuel, by the State Chief Judge, Justice Godwin Abraham, assisted by the Chief Registrar, Justice Nkeruwem Ubut. The inauguration was followed by the signing of the oath and then the official presentation of both the Deputy Governor and the State Governor. Speaking at the event, Governor Udom Emmanuel thanked God and promised to be a servant leader. I stand here again today, as I did in 2015, to promise you that since the God we worship and adore the North Fellows, I, Udom Emmanuel, will not fail you. I will continue to serve you as your servant leader in absolute humility and devotion to your needs and desires. I will appropriate your resources to improve your living conditions and secure the future of our children so they too can be as productive and as fulfilled in their aspirations as their counterparts anywhere else on planet Earth. Urging a quibomite to derope hatred and embrace love. Our own people, I urge you to derope the garment of hatred, of mutual recognition and replace such with the shining apparel of love of togetherness, of unity, and different, and believe in our common essence and values. Amazingly, the governor called an opposition to join hands with him for a better acquibum. I extend my hands of fellowship and born of friendship to my brothers and sisters on the opposite side of the political divide. I call on them to join me in building a step that we all, irrespective of political affiliations, will be proud To commemorate the inauguration, the Aquaibom Entertainment Industry organized a reception at the governor's hometown in Awaiman. Speaking with Memories TV, the people of Aquaibum could not help but express their excitement. I feel good. I'm so excited that today, the May 29th, our governor, our very dear governor, Governor Udom Emmanuel, had been re elected and today inaugurated into office for his second term bid. We are celebrating because violence is now a thing of the past. He is a peaceful governor and we are welcoming him back to office knowing that our future is assured. This inauguration to the Aquaibom people marks the beginning of a new era, even to generations unborn. So we are thankful to God. We are in a joyous mood. Everybody is happy because God has done it for us. <laughs>